Phone cloning is a serious threat. It's like identity theft for your phone. Hackers copy your SIM card or phone information, then they can make calls and send messages as if they were you. Think about it. Someone else could be using your number. They could be accessing your contacts, messages, and even your bank accounts. This is why understanding phone cloning is so important. Phone cloning can happen in several ways. Hackers are always finding new methods. Staying informed is the first step to protecting yourself. In the following sections, we'll delve into the methods and how to safeguard against them. Imagine getting your phone bill and seeing calls to countries you've never even heard of. You might think it's a mistake, but it's not. It's one of the first signs that your phone has been cloned. That's one of the dangers of phone cloning. Hackers can duplicate your phone's unique identifiers and use them to make calls, send texts, and even access your data. Hackers can rack up huge bills in your name, and it gets worse. These charges can quickly spiral out of control, leaving you with a financial nightmare. They can use your cloned phone for criminal activities. Imagine your phone number being used to coordinate illegal transactions or to scam innocent people. Think about it. Illegal transactions, scams, even harassment. The implications are far-reaching and can affect every aspect of your life. And guess who gets blamed? You. Trying to explain to customer service that you didn't make those calls can be a frustrating and time-consuming process. Your personal information is also at risk. Hackers can access your contacts, messages, and social media accounts. They can use this information to steal your identity or target your friends and family. Imagine the horror of your loved ones receiving messages that appear to be from you, but are actually from a hacker. They can use this information to steal your identity or target your friends and family. Identity theft can lead to long-term damage to your credit score and personal reputation. Phone cloning is a serious crime. Law enforcement agencies are constantly battling this issue, but it's a cat and mouse game with hackers always finding new ways to exploit vulnerabilities. It's crucial to be aware of the risks and take steps to protect yourself. Regularly updating your phone's software, using strong passwords, and being cautious about the apps you download can make a big difference. Don't wait until it's too late. Take action now to secure your phone and protect your personal information. Remember, prevention is always better than cure. SIM swapping is a popular method for phone cloning. Here's how it works. Hackers trick your mobile carrier into transferring your phone number to their SIM card. They might do this by providing fake identification or using social engineering tactics. Once they have your number, they have control over your calls, messages, and even two-factor authentication. Think of your SIM card as the key to your phone number. If someone else has the key, they can lock you out. That's why SIM swapping is so dangerous. Protecting yourself from SIM swapping requires vigilance and proactive measures with your mobile carrier. Social engineering is a powerful tool for hackers. It involves manipulating people into divulging confidential information, often without them even realizing it. They use manipulation and deception to trick you into giving them the information they need. This can be done through various means, such as phone calls, emails, or even in-person interactions. In the context of phone cloning, they might impersonate you or a trusted organization. This allows them to gain access to your personal information and use it for malicious purposes. For example, they might call you pretending to be from your mobile carrier. They could claim there's an urgent issue with your account that needs immediate attention. They might say there's a problem with your account and ask for your personal information, like your social security number or your account password. This information can then be used to clone your phone or access your accounts. Never give out sensitive information over the phone unless you initiated the call and you are certain you are talking to a legitimate representative. Always verify the identity of the person you are speaking with. If something feels off, hang up and call back using the official number of your mobile carrier or the organization in question. This simple step can prevent you from falling victim to a scam. It's also important to stay informed about the latest scams and tactics used by hackers. Knowledge is your best defense against social engineering attacks. Implementing security measures like two-factor authentication and regularly updating your passwords can add an extra layer of protection. These steps make it harder for hackers to gain access to your information. Consider attending cybersecurity seminars or workshops to stay updated on the latest threats and how to protect yourself. Being proactive about your security can make a significant difference. Share what you learn with friends and family. The more people are aware of these tactics, the harder it becomes for hackers to succeed. Together, we can create a safer online environment. By staying vigilant and informed, 
you can protect yourself from social engineering attacks and enjoy the peace of mind that comes with knowing your information is secure. The IMEI cloning threat. Every phone has a unique identifier called an IMEI or International Mobile Equipment Identity Number. Think of it like your phone's fingerprint. It's possible, though difficult, for hackers to clone this number and use it to make their phone look like yours to the network. IMEI cloning is more common with older phones that have less secure technology. While it's not as common as SIM swapping, it's still a threat to be aware of. To protect yourself, keep your phone's software up to date. Updates often include security patches that can help prevent IMEI cloning. Can hackers clone your phone with Bluetooth? Bluetooth technology can be a vulnerability if not used carefully. Hackers can use Bluetooth to try and access your phone if your device is not properly secured. They might try to pair with your phone without your knowledge and steal your data. This is called blue snarfing. While less common than other methods, it's still a possibility. To protect yourself, always turn off Bluetooth when you're not using it. And be cautious about pairing your phone with unknown devices. Malware the silent phone cloning weapon. Malware is malicious software that can infect your phone and compromise its security. Hackers can trick you into installing malware through phishing emails, malicious apps, or infected websites. Once installed, malware can steal your information, including your SIM card data, giving hackers the keys to clone your phone. To protect yourself from malware, be careful about the links you click and the apps you download. Only download apps from trusted sources and be wary of emails from unknown senders. Install a good mobile antivirus program and keep it up to date. Protecting yourself from phone cloning attacks. In today's digital age, our smartphones have become an integral part of our lives. They hold our personal information, contacts, and even financial data. This makes them a prime target for cyber criminals. Protecting yourself from phone cloning requires vigilance and proactive measures. Phone cloning is a technique where hackers duplicate your phone's identity to gain access to your personal information and accounts. This can lead to severe consequences, including identity theft and financial loss. Here are some essential tips to keep in mind. First and foremost, always be aware of your surroundings and who might be watching when you use your phone in public places. Use strong, unique passwords for all your accounts, including your mobile carrier account. A strong password should be a mix of letters, numbers, and special characters. Avoid using easily guessable information like birthdays or common words. Enable two-factor authentication whenever possible. This adds an extra layer of security by requiring a second form of verification, such as a code sent to your phone, in addition to your password. This extra step makes it significantly harder for hackers to access your accounts, even if they manage to obtain your password. Be cautious about sharing personal information online and offline. Information like your phone number, address, and even your pet's name can be used by hackers to guess security questions or passwords. Hackers can use this information to target you for phone cloning attacks. They often gather data from social media profiles, public records, and other sources to piece together enough information to clone your phone. Check your phone bill and bank statements regularly for any suspicious activity. Unfamiliar charges or sudden changes in your phone's behavior can be indicators of phone cloning. By following these tips, you can significantly reduce your risk of becoming a victim of phone cloning. Stay informed, stay vigilant, and take proactive steps to protect your personal information and digital identity. Remember, your smartphone is a powerful tool, but it requires responsible use and security measures to keep it safe. Staying ahead of the cloning game. The world of cybersecurity is constantly evolving. Hackers are always finding new ways to exploit vulnerabilities. That's why it's crucial to stay informed about the latest threats. Keep your phone's software up to date, be wary of suspicious emails and links, and follow security best practices. By being proactive and vigilant, you can help keep your phone and your personal information safe from cloners. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you know about phone cloning and other cybersecurity threats, the better equipped you'll be to protect yourself.